What is going on, everyone? We are back with another music reaction. I'm Depraved. I'm Hellcat. And together we are... Hella Depraved. Yes, we are. Oh, I like this mask. It's, <laughs> it's far more comfy than the other one. That's good. That's it good. It is. Uh, so, we are, it's got this like weird... like it, This dips down a little bit lower than this side, though. So it looks like I'm kind of like... Eh. I mean, you know. Anyways. <laughs> uh, we're super excited for this. This is... Uh, the Hound and the Fox, they dropped another cover. They did. We love their covers. And this is Spooky Scary Skeletons. And we're both excited to see how they cover this, considering they're normally more folk than... Right. What would you consider, like, pop, almost, the original? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just... I mean, it's a little jazzy, it's a little pop, it's a right. little... I mean, it's a classic. Uh, who, was the, who was it that did it before? Was it Jeff? Now, we've heard uh, Jonathan Young do it. I think we've heard... Didn't Voice Play do it as well? Was it Voice Play or just Jeff in one of his... I can't remember. ...bass covers? Yeah, it was, so Voice Play or Jeff Castellucci did it. Right. Um, it is definitely already on our October playlist, but... Yes. You know, people are really letting us down this October. They are. Not the Hound and the Fox, not the Merkins, the people that are doing the season correctly are doing the season correctly. But uh, after last year, where there was this a is, deluge of people doing... This is like the only season that matters. Yeah. And none, none, of, none of the people... Fail. Most of the people we know that, like, again, it seemed like a lot of people jumped on board last year. So I was we super so excited, excited for this year. Yeah. And there's been like a small handful of stuff that's it's come out. It's spattering. And it's like... Ugh. A spattering, y'all. But it's I bet all you mother... Not Never okay. Mind. You know what? We're not going to go there. Yeah. If, uh, if I see any of you, not not the hound on the fox, but any of you, if you did not celebrate the spooky season through music, I better not see Christmas music from you. Oh, God. Don't even. Anyway. <sighs> we're here. We're excited. We're excited. So, uh, the hound on the fox, spooky, scary skeletons, duet cover. Let's get it. Oh, the full outfit. Yes. Spooky, scary skeletons send shivers down your spine. Shrieking skulls will shock your soul, seal your doom tonight. Oh, he can do the eyebrow. That is unfair. Yeah, no, I know you can do it too. Y'all suck. I already knew both if, of them could snap after their, uh, you know, our theme song. That she they can't did. snap or raise her eyebrow. Uh, anybody that has been a fan of the rock and wrestling and practiced as a kid. I have legitimate covetous hate right now. I feel very righteous in it, too. <laughs> Shock your soul, seal your doom uh. tonight. Smoky, scary skeletons speak with such a screech. You'll shake and shudder in surprise when you hear these zombies shriek. Who ad-libbed the bass part? Probably him. That was cool. Um, I also like that like he looks over at her and she does not care. No. She's just going. Gives no fucks. No fucks. Uh, I love <laughs> this. It's, it's a beautiful kind of folky, uh, much more jazzy right. cover. And I think it's so appropriate for the song. Here's so my problem with the classics, and I I mean that in terms of like Purple People Eater, Monster Mash, Spooky Scary Skeletons, is that they're so upbeat, upbeat that there's absolutely nothing spooky sounding about the songs themselves, which are a product of their times. I get it. Like celebrating the season wasn't like a big thing then, right? Um, so they had to appeal to the masses but i love this cover because it gives you that hint of slowness that little bit of a haunt behind it you know right plus their outfits like all of the instruments everything like they went all out with the skeleton theme fantastic surprise when you hear these zombies shriek <laughs> so sorry, skeletons, you're so misunderstood. You only want to socialize, but I don't think we should. Cause spooky, scary skeletons shout startling, shrilly screams. They'll sneak 
<laughs> that is him. It's a double of him that's singing the bass. Was that their kid? Do they have a kid? I don't I don't know, but it's maybe, perfect. Maybe a nephew? It's perfect. It's All fantastic. of this has been like even their little shaker is a skull. It's fucking fantastic. Yeah, I love this. smile and scrabble slowly by and drive you so insane <laughs> sticks and stones will break your bones they seldom let you snooze spooky scary skeletons will wake That fiddle, adding that in, oh my god. Okay, you have a complete classic for me. Like, that was a complete classic. That's how it should have been done, in my humble opinion. To begin with. It had the perfect level of haunt and all the ad-libs. I mean, they weren't blast-in-your-face screams, but they were that perfect background. And then adding the fiddle in and just... The pacing of it. Oh, okay. I'm satisfied. I'm quite satisfied. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I absolutely loved it. I'm adding it to my Halloween playlist, regardless of the fact that I think I have a, a, maybe Jeff's cover. I think I have two of them. That's what I was debating. Do I want to add another one? Um, here's the this, thing. This one has such... It's a different feel to it that I'm not even going to be upset if my randomized playlist decides to play them back to back. Um, is it under Haunted Folk? It is. It is. Hey. Makes sense. Uh, Hello to Pretty Shock October. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to add it. What I may do is go through and listen to it and <clears throat> because here's the thing. If... I, I think I have it on there two times already because mm -hmm. I think I have Jonathan Young's and then either Voice Plays or Jeff Castellucci's. Okay. And what I may do is take off um, Jonathan Young's. Right. Because his is still very upbeat. It is. Whether it's rock or not. Right. Um, and I may do that just again to limit how many times it's on there. Right. I mean, again, um, it's a classic that a lot of people like to cover, like right. This is Halloween, which everybody and their mother does, which is a great song. Don't get me wrong, but I can only hear it so many times. Right. So, yes. But this was fantastic. Uh, it was. Uh, I kind of want to cover this whole album, by the way. Right. Well, um, rightfully so. Uh, we've covered quite a bit of it. We have. Uh, considering a, some, a lot of these are some of the songs that they've been putting out the last couple of years. Like Come Little Children, yeah. Jack and Sally's song, so forth and so on. Right next to you's on there. A lot of those are already um, on this playlist of ours. Right. I think there's the As one that had um, Chase from Home Free that came out earlier this month is the only one that we haven't. Right, and I had picked the other song to react to even after they put that one out because I didn't think that that was technically a spooky song. Right, and then we saw it And on then we seen it was on their spooky list. Uh, album. And somebody came so. in and said that it was actually right. relatively haunting. So we will get to that. Yes, we will. Uh, anyways, thank you guys, Hound and Fox, so much for always providing us with fantastic covers, fantastic music, Absolutely fantastic. fantastic arrangements. I've not once been disappointed by anything we've listened to you to from you. Well, and it's so refreshing that somebody 
takes the time when they're doing a cover to truly transform it into their own. A lot of covers, again, it's exactly the same, only right. it's now rock music, but it's the same tempo, the same melody, the same everything, and it's it's just really nice to see people transform it. Right. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we absolutely loved it. So, uh, if you guys liked the video, slash the like button, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, comment down below, what did you think of The Hound and the Fox with a spooky, scary skeleton duet cover? Also, comment down below if there's anything else you guys want to see reacted to, check the description below for all the things. I'm going to work on my um, eyebrow raising power. Since you can't I don't see think, I, got my I don't think on, snapping is going to come to me anytime soon. Maybe I'll just, I'll work on my sneer. That I can do. You've got that down, baby. Thank you. <laughs> anyway, push our buttons. Come join us on our other social media platforms, mostly Twitter if you want a quicker response. We love you guys. Thank you all for watching. Cannot wait to see you to pray people later.